Yo le quiero hacer una pregunta. O dos o tres. Al senador. Mr. President, I'm going to give the answer here just in a second. Este señor Graham se ha dedicado a estarnos atacando. The problem I have with you is that you deny there are areas of your country controlled by drug cartels. Se consume fentanilo en Estados Unidos. Sí o no? Yes, it's consumed in the United States. Here's the problem. This is a very dangerous drug being put in other drugs and Americans are buying it not knowing it. Si hay carteles que distribuyen el fentanilo en Estados Unidos, sí o no? Mexican drug cartels are operating in our major cities, distributing fentanyl. Si sí, se les persigue a los que distribuyen el fentanilo y se les castiga en Estados Unidos. And we're going after them, but I want to do more than go after fentanyl dealers in America. Los que distribuyen el fentanilo en Estados Unidos son mexicanos o estadounidenses. The fentanyl distribution network in the United States involves Mexican drug cartels and others. Si se puede comprar o no un arma de alto poder en los supermercados de Estados Unidos. Mr. President, you can't buy a weapon commercially unless the person has a firearms license. Que me diga qué programas tienen para apoyar a los jóvenes en Estados Unidos con el propósito de que no consuman droga. We're spending millions of dollars trying to educate people about the dangers of drugs, particularly fentanyl. Nosotros no producimos fentanilo. El fentanilo llega de Asia. The product is primarily coming from your country, being produced in areas where you have no authority or control. And if you don't change this policy, you're going to require America to do things that I don't want to do, but we must do. Es atender las causas. No pensar que los problemas sociales se resuelven solo con el uso de la fuerza. I want to educate the public about the danger of drug usage in America, but I want to work with you to shut down these labs. Labs operate openly in Mexico and you're doing nothing about it. You're in denial. Nosotros estamos ayudando no por miedo a sus amenazas intervencionistas. If you choose not to work with me, I'm going to do everything in my power to use the laws of the United States to destroy these drug cartels and whatever is necessary to protect Americans from dying by the tens of thousands. Si no lo hacemos por convicciones humanitarias, porque sí nos importa lo que sucede lamentablemente en Estados Unidos.